One of the enduring myths about the bomb machines at Bletchley Park is that the mathematicians sweated over the design of the machine and it took them years and they had all sorts of challenges and struggles. I don't want to say that they didn't have any challenges or struggles, but frankly, the work that they did was incredibly quick. They got it all done. They had the prototype delivered here by Easter of 1940, really, really early in the war. So from that point, when they'd actually got a machine that was working, the uh, mathematicians and the boffins had really dropped out of the picture and the real work was being done by the technicians who were helping make sure that the bomb machines worked and those guys were typically RAF engineers and the wrens who had the unbelievably boring job of plugging the machines up, doing it, doing their work accurately, setting it up, making, actually finding the settings of the Enigma machine day in, day out, nasty shift work, unpleasant working conditions. And these were the people, these were the unsung heroes of the bomb machine story.